Welcome to Off The Wall, video series about the hat life. Alex with your Gorm Brothers virtual styling team. Here again today with a quick little video. We get a lot of questions on what do I do to prevent sweat stains and what do I do to help prevent sweat stains in fedoras. And it's a quick trip. I can show it to you right now. Let's get to it, y'all. Okay, so this is a common thing that happens with a lot of hats. What happens is you sweat through on fedoras and you'll start to see your sweat bleed through right here on the hat band. You see some salt stains, some oil stains. It just kind of builds up. It makes us very nasty, right? It can be a little difficult to clean. So the best bet you have is preventative maintenance. So I'm going to show you two little quick tricks to do so. But just know there's two different kinds of hat bands within Gorham Brothers. Excuse me, sweat bands within Gorham Brothers hats. First off, we have the cloth sweat band here. So something like this. It'll roll up like this, and this is what I'm going to be showing you. So you'll need that. Or if you have a leather sweat band like say the Colonel Pierce, which has this leather. You're gonna unroll that, and that's what you're gonna be using as well. Leather, in my opinion, a leather sweatband prevents sweat stains a little bit better than cloth. The trade-off is leather can be a little bit tough to break in at first. It's not as comfortable right out of the box as cloth. So there's a trade-off between the two. Anyway, you can use this trick for either sweatband inside. Let's get to it. Okay, so let's start with the first trick. Now, if you're someone that sweats a bunch, even in the winter, totally common, it happens to a lot of people, the easiest thing you can do is carry a bandana around or a rag of some sort. And every once in a while, if you're feeling like you're very sweaty and you're feeling it on your hat, just take this rag and wipe the inside of it. What I would do is wipe both the exterior of the band and the space between the band and the front of the hat, where your forehead touches can wipe your sweat, your sweat off your forehead as well. All those things will help prevent the buildup that will eventually soak through the wool body and then start to soak through that hat band in the front. So that's one trick. Just wipe this off. If you can remember to carry a bandana. If you're a sweater, probably should carry one anyway. Bandana. Okay, so our second trick. We're gonna line our fedora with this. So you're gonna take your bandana, roll it up real thin, just like this. And we're gonna take our hat what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift this front lip. So this is the part where our forehead is touching the hat. Lifting up that band in the front, sweat band that is. Curl that inside and just tuck it right inside. Put this right over. So I'm giving it another barrier. Boom. Now the bandana is between the sweat band and the body of the hat. We have a double lining. We'll make it a little bit more snug, so you want to break it in a little bit, but this is a great extra layer of protection against sweat. Now let's say you don't have a bandana, you need a quick fix, right? Do the same thing with paper towel. So you want to roll this up, make it a nice little thin line. Nice and narrow. Flip that up, tuck it inside. Not as good as a bandana, but it'll do the trick temporarily. Just want to keep on removing that between use. You have an extra layer of sweat protection. That's it. Okay, so hopefully this teaches you an easy way to help sweat, prevent buildup on there, or just keep the longevity of your hat going for a little bit longer, at least the hat band itself. Any questions on this, hit me up on Gorman.com. You can always book an appointment with me as well. Until I see you next time, keep living the hat life.